Yeah, putting 123456 as your password is not going to protect your accounts. And nope, none of these are going to do the job either. See, you need to start using truly, truly safe passwords and probably pick a proper password manager to protect all your info. Okay, but which one, right? Let's find out. Okay, so today I've got a 1Password versus RoboForm comparison just for you. And I've been using both of them for a while now, so I've got a little bit of insight to share that might make your decision a little easier. And when you decide which one to go with, do not forget to use those exclusive discounts right down there in the description to save you a few bucks along the way. Okay, so after testing these password manager options, I discovered that both of them can import passwords from various browsers and of course from other password manager apps. But account recovery works a little differently here. With 1Password, the only saving grace is the emergency kit. While with RoboForm, I was able to set up emergency access by adding a trusted contact. Now looking inside of the apps, features like the password generator work about the same, which is pretty much expected. The only real difference is that RoboForm can generate way longer passwords. However, 1Password can generate phrases, which is a little more handy should you ever need to manually enter your passwords. But look, if we're being honest here, manual input of your data is mostly in the past these days anyway. So having good and intuitive autofill is absolutely necessary for any of the best password manager candidates. And so of course, for this 1Password versus RoboForm review, I tested them both out. With RoboForm, all I needed to do was click on an icon beside the field and boom, I was done. Is 1Password any good in this area? Yeah, it is. But my only note is that it is a little bit clunkier. To access my account, I have to first click on the icon, then the specific login item. If there are more items, well, I have to scroll a bit too which just makes this whole thing a little bit slower than I'd like. Now, password sharing is something that I have to do almost daily at this point. You know, spouse, kids, interns, yada, yada, yada. So how well does that work? Well, it's easy to do with both, actually. It's just a matter of a few clicks. I was able to tweak the access level during my RoboForm review, while 1Password allowed modifying the duration, but I didn't really find any significant differences here. Same goes for password checking. Both password managers alert their users about weak and compromised passwords. 1Password does it by using the watchtower, and I can check the security score right here and see if anything needs some fixing up. Meanwhile, RoboForm has a more official looking security center. I can view not only compromised or old passwords, but the security status of all my logins as well, which is pretty groovy. Now, what about the apps? Well, both password managers support all of the main platforms and have very handy browser extensions. However, you probably already noticed that the interfaces look quite a bit differently. Now, I'd argue that RoboForm Password Manager is more user-friendly, making it a better choice for beginners. The interface is clean, so it's easy to navigate. It looks like it might be a little stuck in the 2000s, but I think this nostalgic approach adds a little bit of charm, don't you? Hmm. So the answer to is RoboForm good and easy to use is a definite yes. But what about 1Password? The apps do adopt a more modern look, but ooh, it's a little more cluttered visually. Yeah, yeah, just look at how much stuff is on the screen all at once. Yeah, so it might take some time to figure out what's what and where it is and how to use it all. But, you know, we regularly do tutorials on this channel, so if you subscribe, well, you'll figure out the apps in no time flat. Now, this RoboForm vs. 1Password review would not be complete without a security review. RoboForm and 1Password are, once again, pretty similar in this area. Now, the both of them offer reliable 256-bit AES encryption, you know, the standard in the marketplace. It's also paired with a zero-knowledge architecture, which basically means that nobody, not even the staff at either company, can see your passwords. This way, the security of your data falls right back into your hands. So, yeah, as always, I recommend that you set up a proper master password and enable multi-factor authentication when possible. Speaking of which, my RoboForm Password Manager review did reveal quite a few authentication options, but 1Password isn't really that far behind. Both support Microsoft Authenticator and Authy apps, but 
you know, I kind of missed the Google Authenticator option after my 1Password review, but hey, it's not that huge of a drawback. So from a security standpoint, I can at least say yes to both. Is RoboForm any good? And is 1Password good? Okay, so it looks like security is a draw, but what about pricing? Which one's gonna bring the better value? Well, both password managers are gonna be easy on your wallet. RoboForm does have a slight advantage here since there is a completely free plan, but that won't necessarily win this RoboForm versus 1Password comparison for them. See, the plan is limited to one device. There's no 2FA, so yikes, it's really just a very basic stripped down version. And it's really mostly designed for just testing it out. Now, of course, I did do a premium plan review. 1Password is slightly pricier currently, and I'd actually say it's worth it if you could use those additional features like maybe say the travel mode to lock your sensitive data to one location. But besides that, the choice should come down to which interface you're gonna like more and how much you're willing to spend. And you know what? You could actually always use the leftover money you save for something else, like a coffee run, a ticket to a movie, or maybe a cool sweater from our merch shop. Check it out after the video. I think you'll like them. So okay, after you're done watching this review, I want to know which one you're going to pick. The cheap and beginner-friendly RoboForm or 1Password? Password Manager Review can only say so much. I mean, you really got to go and test the apps out for yourself. And hey, if you've done that, well then let us know about your experience down there in the comments. If not, grab that special deal from this box in the corner and protect your passwords from prime purveyors of plundered and pillaged data. Hey, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.